Hey y'all, so what I'm going to be doing here is showing you a method I use to try and defeat the bosses in boss mode. Then after I'm done with that, I'll try and defeat a boss that I haven't defeated there yet and see if the method works. So here's my profile here. You can see I have most of the stuff in the game unlocked. You're going to need the hawk wings. That gives a shield when superpower is active. That's kind of essential for this strategy to work. So this basically all relies on the Hurricane Hawk ship, or in my instance, a Transformer Hawk. You must have the following two expert items, and that is Phoenix Rise and the expert item over here, Champion Squad. Those two expert items are kind of essential for this. Plus it does help if you have quite a few crystals like I do as well. You also need a very specific pilot squad. If we go over to the pilot squad, you can see I have it equipped. It's the Raptor squad. Starts the match with Wisdom Glory or Hurricane Hawk. So you kind of have to rely on luck. You need the Hurricane Hawk to drop at the start. Then with a bit of luck, that will activate Super Time and Invincibility. Then every time you die, you have a decent chance to get more invincibility. And that should get you through quite a few of the bosses in boss mode. I think it's the best method I have seen so far anyway. So what I'm going to do is scroll through to, I think, Electro. That's quite a tough boss, but not one that's super hard. You can see I don't have any of the stars at the top of the screen with the other bosses. You can see I have two and three. This boss I have never defeated in endless mode, even though I have obtained all the crystals from the boss. That's from defeating it in endless. So this may take quite a few attempts. It relies on Hurricane Hawk being dropped at the start rather than Wisdom Glory. If Wisdom Glory drops, then there's pretty much no point in continuing. I'll just restart. So I'll only show you the run where I actually defeat this boss. Bear in mind, it may have taken me a lot longer than just the one attempt. Right, so there's the Hawk ship. Need to get that carefully. Then hopefully, with a bit of luck, the super time will activate. And then I have invincibility. Now, I could have picked that ship up to get the Element Lord. But I want to try and do this without. Now, if I die with a bit of luck, I should get a super time. But so far, I've actually taken down quite a lot of the health without needing the super time. This boss isn't actually that difficult. On crazy mode, though, it would be pretty insane. Right, let's try this out anyway. Yeah, the super time is activated, so I can go in there and get as much damage as possible on the boss with invincibility. And then... I should, with a bit of luck, take down one of the parts in a minute. Oh, there we go. That attack's quite difficult to avoid. But yeah, I think this is kind of one of the only ways you can do boss mode on some of the later bosses on hard or crazy. I haven't found any other methods that really work so far. You need the super time and invincibility at the start. There we go. That's the boss defeated anyway. It wasn't actually that difficult if I'm being honest. I did need one revive though as you saw. So I felt that was maybe a little bit too easy so let's up the stakes a bit. So let's give this boss a try on medium and see if this strategy still works. I may need to pick up other ships though this time around to make it a bit easier. Right so there's the Hawk ship. I need to get that before I get obliterated at the start. Then hopefully the super time will activate. I can go in there and get some damage. Now you can see how fast the attacks are. And this is just on medium. Crazy mode gets even worse. So try and survive. Right, that was pretty good. I've used up pretty much all the super time. This attack's easy to avoid. But I think when it starts shooting at me with its arms, so to speak, I'm going to die. Look how fast that is. Anyone who can dodge that is superhuman. What? Did I actually survive? Okay, first revive, no super time, unfortunately. I should have really picked up the legendary, but I want to do it with this ship. 
just to show it can be done with a basic ship. Let's see what it does. This attack's easy. I didn't get the super time from the revive you probably saw. That attacks. The thing that killed me was the other ship in the way. Probably all saw that. Right, so we've got it down to the one part you can see here. These attacks are not that easy to dodge, but not impossible. So I may need to use revives and super times. I'm going to pick that up and just get it done, to be honest, as I'm using all my crystals up. There we go, boss defeated, and I got a bonus crystal as well. So it does work on harder difficulties as well. On the harder bosses, you will need to use crystals, though, unless you are ridiculously skilled at the game. So there we go, that's electro defeated on medium. I'm not going to do it on hard as well. I probably could win, but it's going to take me a lot of attempts as the attacks start to get stupid fast. The other way you can get the crystals is by playing the matching campaign stage for the boss. For example, Electro is on 31 here, so multiply that by 4 to get the campaign stage, and that should be 124. So what you can do is scroll down to there, play it on the difficulty that you need the crystals from and get them from there. That's a much easier method than trying to get the crystals from boss mode since you can start with legendary. That's something I thought I'd point out though. If you are just wanting the crystals for the bonus damage on the boss, it's probably easier to go to the matching campaign mission rather than defeat it from boss mode. Anyway, I hope that was interesting and helpful. I'm going to end the video at this point. If you do have any questions or suggestions regarding this, please let me know in the comments and I'll do my best to help. If you did enjoy this video, please do give it a like and subscribe to the channel. Subscribing is always very much appreciated. I have included a previous video on the screen, plus a playlist. Plus you can also subscribe from here if you want to do so. And thanks for watching.